this is a low RPM test just to measure whether or not I have significant vibration. I do not have this thing hooked up to the scale. It is very simply going to move forward slightly. I am building a better stand for this. This is temporary and I'm not going up on the RPMs. We're just going to see if it's going in the right direction <laughs> and if it's going to uh, vibrate at all. Oh, wait, I should probably turn on the uh, radio first. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to try and go up as slow as humanly possible. Wrong direction. Okay, hold on. Okay. Just a second. Because the idea is I want to make sure that it's not going to present any issues at higher RPMs. Whew. Okay, a little nervous. So far, so good. What I'm going to do is probably get a different battery because I don't know if this one's good, bad, or ugly. We've got an IC5 to an XT90. And I know that this battery is pretty decent. So we'll see if that works. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh, throttle all the way down. Okay. I was hearing slight vibration, so I want to be very careful. destroy the turbine <laughs> although I do have a vibration issue I need to work out it is causing some heat in there so we're gonna investigate that that's why this is clamshelled and not glued in place um, with the exception of the motor mount itself so looks like a small motor mount misalignment 
you can kind of see it. So that I can fix easy enough. I'll just pop all that off, reprint the mount itself, which is just this um, this section here, and that only takes a few minutes. It almost feels like it's one. It's got to be up in this way a little bit more, <laughs> which may have something to do with the way this was attached here. So okay, we're gonna get on that. <laughs>